Welcome to No Big Gaming. We make videos on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Today we are playing a game that I've never heard of before. It's called Hugo's House of Horrors. This should definitely show we definitely play a little bit of everything. Yeah. I could find an older game for you if you want. No. This is good enough? Yeah, this is this is good enough. This is one that I really did enjoy. I played quite a bit as a kid. This is actually part of a trilogy. What's that? There are, there's three games in the Hugo series. Really? Yeah. So it was, uh, there was the next one was um, Hugo. What do I have to do? Open door. It is locked. It recognized it without a space even. And then the last one was in a Three? jungle. Open door. It is locked. Ah, okay. What do I do? So you need to actually break that pumpkin. Break pumpkin. Okay. <laughs> I said okay. The pumpkin breaks open. To reveal a key. Okay. Pick up key. Hey, quick learner. Pick up the key. You don't need the mouse. You can just hit enter on these Unlock windows Unlock door. Okay. Just hit enter. There you go. Go in the door. There you go. There you go. Who's that? Grab that candle. Pick up candle. Grab my work. I don't know. Wow. There you go. Skin Look fish. under the stairs. Yeah, I see that. Go under stairs. Try walking there. <laughs> Look under. Look under. I don't see anything much in here. Wait, there's a little pink pink knife lying in the dust on the floor and next to it is a little silver whistle. We fetch them out. Pick up silver whistle. Pick up the whistle. I wonder what that whistle is for. Get the knife. Get the knife. Yeah. Pick up knife. Go in that first room. Open door. Okay. Open cabinet. You're not close enough. Okay, open the door, but get a little closer. Open door. Open. Pick up. He doesn't know what you're trying to pick up. I don't know what that is. Say look. Look. Look in cabinet. Oh, there you go. Pick up mask. Pick up mask. Pick up the mask. There's nothing under there. I'll save you that time. Okay. <coughs> Soap and door. Hmm? <laughs> you had an extra S in there. Oh. The people can't see your typos though, because my there. camera's in the way. Yeah. Wait, really? Well, they can see it if you type that much. Oh, yeah, that's what I wanted to see. Uh, there is a code in that mirror. Yeah, look in the mirror. Look at mirror. Look at mirror. There you go. You arrives at the bathroom. In case you weren't aware. Why, why didn't he look, look at mirror? at mirror. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, because you don't know how to spell mirror, apparently. I'm spelling mirror. Look. And you were in the spelling bee. Mirror. No. That's how you spell mirror. No, it's not. How? You that had an extra I three, in there. Three, three, yep. Okay. Look in toilet. He's not looking in the toilet. I'd rather not. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to go in the last room. Look at painting. Bad work of art. Go in the last room. Ah, oh, there you are. I've been looking all over the house for you. Look, you're late, and we haven't we haven't much time. Step into the box, and we'll begin the experiment. The professor beckons you to step into the large cubicle in the center of the room. That's not the center of the room. Yeah, it's pretty close. You idiot! Professor storms. Off, leaving you alone with Eager. He opened the door, though. Go behind the glass now, now that you're small. Walk around it. So now you can get the bung off the table. Pick up bung. Pick up what? Bung. B-U-N-G. What's a bung? It's like a rubber stopper. So now you have to go back in there. Go back, no. You have to go back in the in the chamber. Now you need to tell Igor to uh, press. Uh, you have to get changed back. So he pressed the red button. Tell him to press the red button. That was the last one. Press the red button. Oh, tell Igor. Press. Tell say Igor. Press red button. Igor. I I G O. I G. There you go. Press red button. Igor def definitely pressures the yellow button. <laughs> <laughs> I'm huge. I'm big. Can I so, smack Igor? No, but now go tell him to press the yellow button. I'm See great. how you, yeah. So now go tell him to press the yellow button. Igor. E. Gore. Press. Yellow. Butt. Oh <laughs> Am I bloody? Oh my gosh! No, you're just half see through. Now tell him press the other button. Tell him press. What did he just press? Green? Tell him Eagle. press the green button. Press green button. Oh my gosh, Igor. <laughs> you're wrecking me. Am I normal? I'm normal. Okay, now you can leave. Okay, finally. Get your mask on the way out. Pick up mask. Wear your mask. Wear. Wear mask. Oh, I look ugly now. Yeah, but you need it. Why? Because we're going to go straight across in that room on the right. Look at painting. Okay, I will. Okay, then. Okay, well, now make a right, I guess. Pick up the room. Talk to that butler. 
So you can't go into this room Talk. without the mask on. To Butler. There we go. So you hit enter because he asked you if you wanted a chop and we need that chop. Okay. I don't know what you hit. Take off. No, 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 no. Go back in there. You didn't pick up the chop, I don't think. Where's the chop? I don't think. I don't know. May we have it? Fuck. No, that doesn't work. I don't see one on the floor. Maybe he got it automatic. You already have it. Okay, good. Okay. So now we need to go up, outside there. So you need the mask to disguise yourself as a monster. So, unlock door. Unlock. Open door. Open. Open door. Uh -huh. <gasps> and the door, this door. I say, surely you know this. need to look. Did you read that? Sort of. Sort of? What did it say? Oh. You are behind the house now and what happens to be important to rear to the rear of the garden is a little shed. Yeah, I see that. There should be an oil can out here, I think. Where? Grab oil can. How am I supposed to see that? <laughs> I think if you look in the right place, he sees it. How do I use the oil can on? Um, a lock. Okay, hold on. Go back in there. We're going to go in that door on the left, but don't go in there yet. Type in throw chop, but don't hit enter. Throw chop. Okay, so as soon as you walk in that, uh, that room in the left, a dog is going to run towards you. And that's when you hit enter. Because you're going to throw the chop so the dog runs. Got yeah. it? Yep, go ahead. Reaction time, reaction time. There you go. Look in the mouse hole. Seems to have caught the dog's attention. Yep. Look in the mouse hole. I don't remember if there's actually... You rummage around in the hole and see, feel something soft and fly Phew, a medium-sized pile of mouse droppings. Okay. Okay, yeah, there's nothing. Okay, move the, uh, leave the dog food alone. Uh, move rug on the right side. Move the rug. You're not close enough. Of course I'm not. Yeah, it's the right side of it. Move rug. What you found? A trap door. Oil bolt. Oil you put it here. Now it's like uh. Well, no, you have to move bolt. Move door. bolt. It's like unlock bolt or loosen bolt. One of the two. Loosen. I can't remember. Bolt. <laughs> Open door. I I can't remember. It's something like this. Open. Trap. 
The trap door appears to be bolted shut. Unbolt? Unbolt. Oh my gosh, really? <gasps> Dude, loosen bolt. That's what I did. Oh, we tried that? Um. <laughs> Um, Tape, oil, bolt. We did that. Tape, out, rusty, bolt. Remove bolt? Remove bolt. Take, bolt. Grab, bolt. No. Take bolt. What else do we have? You wouldn't use a knife on the bolt. <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna be like why would I do that? No point. <sighs> Undo bolt. Open door. Open door. Open. Door. There aren't any. Open trap door. Of course. Oh my gosh. I'm glad you figured that out, because I didn't know. I suppose you had to try, and you just to say the door's locked. No, it's, there's an exit this way. We can get out. I think it's between these rocks. Be between the two, I think. What rock? So it's these two rocks. Blow whistle. No, not now. Oh. Don't do that. Stop. Stop moving. We want to do it. We want to save that and do it as soon as we get outside. It messes up the bats. See? Okay, so here is the part where this gets difficult. For I mean, okay, so stop for a second. Let's stop for a second. Let's figure out how we we're going to create a save here before mummy. What? This is the part where you gotta get the mummy captured before the rocks. So I think you need to go straight up, like right away. So you're going straight forward, straight up, all the way, straight, straight, all the way. Okay, so I think F5 will Before mummy. Did we take a screenshot? No. no, here we go. So I think we go up like here. Oh, crap. 
See, this is why we save, because this one is, it's rough trying to get this just right. He follows you, so you got him caught on that rock. And then you have to get, oh, I got caught on the rock. You have to get him caught on the other one? Yeah, so you, you get him around that rock, and then you get him caught So you get them on this rock, and then you get them. There you go. Here. There. Wow. Grab coins or grab money. See why I said that? See why I said I was like, we need to save here. Stop! 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 You're. Yeah. Okay. So cut rope. Get in boat, and then push off. Now get in, get in boat. <laughs> Definitely get in boat this time. <laughs> oh Wait. my gosh. Plug hole no, we, I, with. Oh yeah, with bong. Oh yeah. Get in I'm glad you remembered boat. that because we totally forgot that we didn't do that. Push off. Push off. Okay, there you go. We're in the boat. Okay. Are we almost at the end of the game? Okay, so talk to this man. That's a man? Yeah, talk. You ought to be aware that talking, oh my gosh. talking to oneself is the first time. Talk to man. Talk to man. The old man seems about to speak. Ah, oh, welcome to my lake. I'm fine, young friend. I have been waiting for you. I am well aware of your quest, and I have hastened you on your way. However, before I let you pass, I must safely, I must satisfy myself that you have the experience to handle the dangers that lurk through yonder passage. To, to this end, you will permit me to test your metal with a few questions and the answers to which would come read, readily readily to, readily to the lips of any seasoned adventurer. Be warned, however, that I can only accept your first answer. What was the first name of the hero in The Hobbit? Bilbo. Bilbo? B. Yep. I-L-B-O. Like that? Yep. Hit enter. Correct. And the next question is, where did... Asian live. Narnia, capital N, A R, N I A, K. Who invented Count Dracula? Brom Stroker. Stroker, a Stoker, not Stroker. Stoker. Uh, that's with an A, not an O. No, I'm uh, sorry. Go back. The first name has an A. B R A. Brom. Stoker. Yeah, O K E R. Yep, hit OK. What should you do with a pan galactic gargle blaster? C, drink it. C? Did I just type C? Yep. And now I read it. What's the name of the only mammal that can't fly? That can fly? Man. Man? Yep. What do you mean? How's that? How's that? Wait, what? I don't understand. Hold on. <laughs> the name of the only mammal that can't fly, that can fly. That can't fly, that can fly. That doesn't make any sense. We can't fly, but we have airplanes. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, it... Man. No. Like that? There you go. Yes. Nearly there. Just two more to go. What was the name of Roy Rogers' dog? Bullet. Bullet? Mm-hmm. And lastly, are you sure you want to rescue Penelope? That's the whole point of these games is to rescue your girlfriend. Yes.
Wonderful. Though are thou art truly a noble and wise adventurer, go in peace and my friend and good luck in thy mission. So get out of the boat. Camera out of the boat. So go through that doorway. I'm hitting the IP. There we go. Who is that? Should that's we say the guard. It? No, that's the guard. We should be alright. I think you give him the treasure. Give guard treasure. You hand over one coin from your little bag of going coins. He takes a gruff noise, which you assume was a thank you, and steps aside, allowing you to pass. Nearly there, Hugo. What's that? Is that Penelope? There we go. But we have 198 out of 200. I'm not sure where our other two points are. Wait. There's points? Yeah, at the top. See? Score. 198 oh. out of 200. But how do we get points? Uh, we As we complete. And so actually, after I found out that this game... Because a lot of people pick this up through like abandonware sites. Mm -hmm. The developer of this game... Uh, David Gray actually still sells this game. You can buy this game directly through the guy who originally developed this game. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, so it, it's not real expensive. I think originally when I bought it, it was $10. I think it's down to like $6, but you get all three games and a uh, actually a strategy guide for the three games. Oh, that's cool. All in one nice little package. Oh. And you support the original developer rather than just downloading the games for free. So mm. I thought it was kind of neat. And they're games that I enjoyed as when I was younger. So I thought it was kind of cool. Hmm. That's a cool developer. Yeah. So I was happy to give the guy some money for his games that it? I played. Yeah, that's where I bought these. Um, I've had them for a long time. Ever since mm. I found out that he was still selling them. Hmm. So I thought it was kind of neat. I paypal them the uh, money to uh, get the the trilogy since I've always enjoyed them. Hmm. So. That's cool. This is a fun game. So um, leave suggestions for games you, uh, you would like us to play in the comments below and until next time. Until next time.